Hey people, it's your boy Sarah Ken here. Hope you're doing all right. So nowadays, at 85 on Metacritic, it's a bad score. <laughs> yeah, and some people don't understand what's happening. Why? The Xbox fanboy are calling out medias for being biased because Halo 5 only getting at 85. This is bad. Oh my God, bad score. And why also? The PlayStation fan base and fanboys are clowning them, and some YouTubers are making fun of the situation too, clowning the Xbox fanboys. And it's simple, okay? That shit started back early 2015 when the order came out, and the Metacritic for that game was at 63. And back then it wasn't about media bias. 63 it was because that game was dog shit. This is the words on YouTube, dog shit. It was normal for them to clown the PlayStation fan base because one the the, uh, the other received a 80, uh, oh 80, <laughs> uh, 63 on Metacritic. That was just okay because it was a PlayStation game. And since then they have been telling people oh, PlayStation has no good, good game, blah blah blah. It's only visual, eye candies. That's okay. They've been using this as uh, bullets. Then Bloodborne came out, 92 on Metacritic. And since then, they have been warning them of telling people it doesn't matter. Xbox will get the best game in 2015. And uh, all those games will outclass even Bloodborne 92 on Metacritic. Because for an Xbox fanboy, Metacritic score is great. And if your game uh, not getting a good Metacritic score, it's because it sucks even though they never try the game. And I tried the other, and I played the other, I enjoyed the game end of the story i don't care about what another man think i don't care about another man's opinion right but the irony here it's not that the halo is him bad score by any means it's the irony is their own stupidity because at 85 it by it by no means a bad score but for a halo game and for people who've been running them of telling people that halo will outclass everything on playstation and then we uh, then realize that the game only a and I say only in the uh, in the case uh, in this case, because for them Halo will outclass even Bloodborne Metacritic because Metacritic is important, <laughs> and that shit didn't happen. Okay, I mean when Gear came out, okay, the remaster game, they, those guys was acting like it was a new game and acting like 82 on Metacritic was a bad score. 82 for a remaster, bad score. So, that's why they are getting clowned. And the same people went out calling out media's bias for a 86 on Forza. Okay, on Forza 6. 80 fucking 6 media's bias. Really? <laughs> and now, the best game in Xbox uh, on Xbox came out. The best franchise on Xbox. The most selling games on Xbox came out. Okay, I mean the, mes the best, best selling exclusive came out okay and they thought that game would outclass bloodborne so they can rob those stupid facts of the playstation fan base and fanboys face and that didn't happen halo 5 it's a 85 simple as that yes some people are saying yo okay it's not mature blah 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 of the playstation fan base to make fun of them yo it's only a comeback that's how i see it okay i'm not losing my time making fun of xbox fan because halo uh, not doing as good they, they were thinking it will do but yo if you are a halo fan go out buy your game it doesn't matter if uh, fucking journalists are saying uh uh the single player is not that good or agent luck it's fucking boring this is some other people opinion go out if you enjoy the game enjoy your goddamn game buy it buy it that's it you don't need to uh, to notice what fanboy has to say what the fucking media have to say and that's what i've been telling you gamers since the other when, uh, since the order came out right that's what i've been telling you it doesn't matter if you like the game even if that game is dog shit for everybody world right it's a good game it's a good game because you like it end of the story but now halo is receiving some good score but it's not enough for those fucking fanboy and they they not, now they all depressed and I, I heard one of them say that the reason that game received bad score at 85 on metacritic right it's because Agent Luck was black. A racist card. Really? Dude, you just make us all gamers and black people look, uh, look bad. <laughs> I almost say luck. <laughs> Agent Luck. Man. Anyways, man. So that's it. 
it's not okay it's it's nothing special okay just people cloning those fool youtubers and playstation fan and by no means okay playstation fan didn't know that a 85 on metacritic is a good score it's just because you know it's just fun to make uh, those xbox fanboys look bad because they have been wanting their mouth telling people uh halo will be the best thing there will be no game on uh, on playstation uh, doing their holiday okay there's no there's no fallout mm -mm, that won't happen there's no call of duty there's no game we have nothing to play in the end of the year that's how stupid those guys are and that's why they are getting clown right now end of the story man and should we stop uh, making fun of them but personally i'm not making fun of them now okay and like i said if you into halo and you like that type of uh, that type of game go out and support your game that's it people it's your boy Cyrakin. bye bye a appris à vous battre ainsi. Le sorceur que vous avez tué.